Welcome back everyone, AirPods 3s just came out and most of you may know but AirPods are the headphones that used to come inside of Apple's cases. Uh, some of them had you know the little audio jack at the end but also some of them had the lightning port at the end of them too. So let's go and kind of compare these two, see which ones you should go and pick up. Now obviously if you have the money I think getting the AirPods 3s are the better way to go. These things have a lot of capability, I'm a huge fan of these. But there is a slight problem that I've already made a video about that just doesn't really fit right. These just don't fit right in my ear. I'm not a fan of it. I like the capability behind these, but the fact that they don't fit in my ear is a huge problem. Now with the AirPods or EarPods, these things fit perfectly in my ear, which is crazy because these things are so much cheaper than AirPods. I mean, yeah, they are outdated because they have, you know, the wire and you have to literally plug it into the end of your iPhone like this. But there are still some reasons why I love EarPods and I use them all of the time over even my AirPods. I literally own all the AirPods that ever came out and I think I use EarPods more than AirPods, which is so crazy. Now, the main reason for this is probably because of battery life and connectivity issues. So with AirPods, some of you may know this, you may not know this, I run a second channel too, which is literally just full of how-to tutorials. And a lot of those tutorials that do well are AirPod tutorials, like things like why the AirPods aren't connecting this and that. And that is a pretty big issue that I used to deal with, that I still deal with. And with EarPods, I've never had any connectivity issues. I've also never had any battery issues because these things don't have batteries inside of them. So because of that, you're almost guaranteed not a better experience, you're guaranteed, I think, a smoother experience on the AirPods, even though they don't have enough features, they don't have you know crazy features or anything. I've always just been able to pick these things up, plug them in, and move on with my life. With AirPods, it's like sometimes they work, sometimes you have to connect them, sometimes they disconnect, and then your music plays out loud randomly. It's so crazy. I've had lots of issues with my AirPods throughout the years. EarPods, it's never really been the case, and I'm a humongous fan of them, but they're not perfect. I don't really like the wire too much. If you're planning on working out a lot and you're planning on, you know, going on bike rides and stuff, if you're running, I mean, you can always tuck these under your shirt, which is nice. But if you're running and everything, sometimes your hand will get caught in the headphones and rip them out of your ears. And the durability of these things haven't really been super crazy, to be honest. These wires can snap very easily. And even the head ear pods themselves, if they're intact, there is so much room for just so many things to go wrong that I'm just not a huge fan of either. I mean, you can tear these up in like two seconds if I really wanted to. AirPods, I think, are more durable. And a huge advantage of AirPods is actually the waterproofness. So within the AirPods, I don't know if the case is waterproof, but you actually do end up having a waterproof kind of device which makes it a little bit easier to kind of maneuver with if you're planning on going swimming, which I don't think you should swim with your AirPods in. But if you're planning on doing some super intensive tasks like that, getting AirPods like this will probably end up being a better experience, I think, in my opinion. So if you want something that's a little bit more durable, definitely picking up something like AirPods 3s are the better way to go. But on top of that, you do have things like spatial audio. That is a big feature with these AirPods. In my opinion, I like spatial audio. I like active noise cancellation more, and these ones don't have it. But you know, the fact that these things have spatial audio is really cool. They also have a little button on the side right here, which you can actually configure to do different things. So these things also support better bass quality too, which is also really, really cool. And I'm a huge fan of that. And the stems are much smaller and they are way more portable to use. Although they have the case here, it's not like you have to have the case with you at all times. As long as your AirPods are charged, you can pretty much just go grab the case and just put the AirPods in your ear and then move on from there. But the thing with the AirPods, is that they lack a ton of features. These things pretty much don't have many features at all. The sound quality really isn't that bad though. The bass hasn't really been super horrible. Obviously the bass on the AirPods 3s are going to be better. But the other thing with these AirPods is that at the edge right here, we actually do have a little system controls little area. So we have the plus and minus button. We can easily go and increase and decrease the volume very, very easily. We can still do this on our AirPods, but you do kind of have to shimmy them around a little bit, click the button, all that stuff. With these ones, you click the plus and minus and you pretty much move on from there. But you can also click on the button right here to pretty much toggle Siri. You can go ahead and do a lot of other things too with this button in the middle. So I say that to say, because these things pretty much feel and run the same way as that button on the AirPods, and in fact, I think this button is better because you can easily go and increase the and decrease the volume like this. You can also silence phone calls and stuff by clicking this button. I'm a huge fan of these AirPods just because of that. And on some of you also have this little thing right here so you can go and attach this wire to. 
But like I mentioned, I'm not really a huge fan of the wire. These things just take up so much space. And like I said, they're just really easy to go ahead. I mean, you can see it right here. They're just so easy to kind of just move around and you can just, you know, if I just went like this, like twice, if I really pulled hard enough, I could easily break it. I've broken tons of these throughout the way. And to be honest, even if you don't break it, the other thing to keep in mind is that just by moving your air, just by moving the wire like this every single day, you know, plugging it in, plugging it out, not only are you wearing down your iPhone charger, like your charging port, you're wearing down these ear pods, but you're also wearing down the wire. Every so often, little by little, you're going to go like this, you're going to go like this. And one day, just like the iPhone chargers, they're just going to start tearing around here and they're going to not really necessarily tear up here. But these things, like I mentioned, they're just much easier to break. And because of that, but there's also a lot of issues with AirPods as well. I mean, these things aren't perfect and they have a lot of problems too. I mean, I've never seen like a perfect set of AirPods. And with something like these, you know, with AirPods, I feel like they're more stable. You know, if I was going on a long trip somewhere, like a long road trip, I would probably pick up ear pods, even though I own AirPods. And like I mentioned, the main reason for that is because they're just so much easier to connect to my device and I don't have to worry about battery life. I'm missing out on things like spatial audio and I guess like the, I got maybe better microphone and wireless charging case and all that stuff and maybe looking cool, but I just prefer the stability of AirPods. I, I just use these all the time. And because of that, I just kind of think earpods may be the better way to go for a majority of you out there. I just think if you're just if, they, if you already have them, these are solid. But like I mentioned, if you're cool with AirPods, right? You're already planning on buying AirPods, these are the best things you can buy, in my opinion, for your iPhone. A perfect accessory. And the main reason for this is because they're wireless. You can just plug them onto a charger and move on with your day. The spatial audio is nice. The AirPods Pros are much nicer because you do have, you know, the active noise cancellation and transparency mode, which is really cool. And although I'm not a fan of charging this up and having to do all that, it is nice not to have to worry about wires. You know, if you look at all how much wire you have right here and it goes all the way to the floor, it's not a good look. And it's just like something that can just like, you can lose these easily. You can lose these easily too. But with a wire, it, it just hangs out and it's just not as portable. You have to plug out your headphones if you're going to walk somewhere sometimes. And it's kind of annoying. But you also don't have to worry about battery life really with these. These things last forever. There's actually batteries built in, but these things just last forever. They just take battery from the iPhone. With AirPods, it's a little bit different. You can pretty much pick up AirPods and just be on a wireless mode your whole life. So audio quality and everything, definitely going to sound better on the AirPods. It's a tighter fit, better bass, like I mentioned, better EQ, so much better quality of headphones on the AirPods 3s. But I do actually like, you know, not having to worry about battery life, not having to, you know, worry about connecting my Bluetooth and this and that and half the time and not working and all that. So definitely when it comes down to it, I'm a fan of both. I think, you know, definitely I would rather have AirPods. If AirPods could just have unlimited battery life, I would definitely pick these up. But I'm definitely a fan of AirPods. And like I said, I use AirPods a lot more than I use AirPods in my opinion. Even though I have all the AirPods, I pretty much use AirPods just because they are just so much more reliant. So just because I don't have to worry about battery life and I don't have to worry about really anything else with these. So that pretty much covers it up. If you guys have any other questions or anything like that, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.